So today I'm just here to talk to you about a couple of little things about uh, fat calipers and measuring tapes to get your like fat percentage and things and how you use them and what you'd use them for. So you know it's really not a good indicator to tell you um, exactly how much body fat you've got. Where it'd be better to use it so say one week you um, you just stay the same body weight and your measurements go down in certain spots so you'll be able to use that as an estimate to see if your fat and um, other things are coming off like they should be okay so i'll go through them and we'll see what mine were and what they said but like i said what they're saying that it is i don't believe that that's right at all i don't think it'd be right but anyway um so first is the calipers so the calipers say i'm um, 11 percent body fat they say I need to lose <clears throat> 13 kilos for my lean body mass weight and um, my lean body mass weight is meant to be 112 kilo but um, I don't believe that's right we'll um, check that out so that's basically my um, measurements there so you know we'll just go from 11 and obviously if I get a week where I uh, don't lose any weight but my calipers go down and my measurements go down, they both go down. I know I'm still on track and I don't got to panic as yet and change out and switch out as much things. So I hope you can help to use this for yourself and um, be able to integrate it in with your training and in with your diet and other things to keep you on track instead of thinking, oh shit, it's not working. You know, it's another way that you can know that it's working. Another good way is pictures and um, you know, do a picture every uh, two to three weeks or four weeks. It's another good way to gauge it, but we'll go from there. So next is the measuring tape. So by the measuring tape, <clears throat> it said I was 10% body fat and I had 13 kilos to lose. And the same, you know, my lean body mass was the same, 12. Um, so, you know, like I says, I believe that's not right because if I was like at 10% body fat, I'd, all my abs and that would be in by now. So, you know, I, I think that that's wrong. You know, that's like, I don't really think there's a proper way that they can measure it. They said it's close to like their de dexter scan and this and that, but I don't believe that that um, accurately tells you what it is. The best way you can do is gauge by the mirror and see what the mirror tells you. And the mirror doesn't lie, so, you know, um, that's what you go by. Huh? Okay, um, I hope this helps and um, I'll put another one of these out when I get to a sticking point. If um, it was effective, if it's not effective, I'll put other things into play. Um, hope to catch you then. Please stay tuned, subscribe to the channel and see you then.